To my beautiful wife. I did have to write this down, mate, so I had to read off the script. <laughs> Kez, you, you, you look gorgeous. Yeah, I don't have to read that. You look gorgeous. Not dissimilar to that day about 12 years ago, actually. From that day, I loved everything about you, even when you didn't get taller than me. <laughs> there was once a time that was the case. Your selflessness, love and loyalty are second to none. Despite spending such a large portion of our relationship apart, you have always been there for me, for us. <laughs> Not only have you been patient with the phrase, it depends what the weather's doing, you can drive the boat on the trailer, bait your own hook and outfish me. You are most definitely my, yeah, the boys plus one. You are my best friend. I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together, start a family and grow old together. for a few heartfelt stories and, of course, a few laughs. It's heartwarming for Kez and Willie to know that every person in this room today is here to celebrate the two of you. Now, the first time I met Kez was at Harvey Bay. We happened to be walking down a hospital corridor and as soon as I saw this lovely woman, I stopped Dawn over and rather abruptly threw my hand out for a shake. Introduced myself as I knew we were going to be friends. And as luck, or maybe fate would have it, we were later reunited at the Gladstone Hospital. Now, neither of us have ever actually known Kez without Willie or with or Willie without Kez. Our adventures together began in Gladstone and Gladstone has had a starring role in their story of these two lovebirds. Having done many, many years of long distance, it was their first home and the start of their family with the introduction of Z-Dog. It was also in Gladstone that this mad keen couple purchased Jerkin, sorry, I mean Jackin Reds. beautiful best friend Kerry. Thank you for all you do for us. It's been an honour to stand by you today and we can't wait to be a part of the next chapter. To the beautiful bride, to Kerry. <laughs> I'm not the lovey-dovey, huggy kind of dad, but today it nearly brought me a tear to my eye. Walking down that aisle, I thought, this is sweet, I got this under control. But halfway down, I tell you, I'd shaken my boots. Kerry, it has been the proudest moment of my life to walk you down the aisle today. I wanna stand with you on a mountain. I wanna bathe with you in the sea. I wanna lay like this forever until the sky falls down. Joy for all the pleasure and the certainty that we're surrounded by the comfort and protection of the highest powers in lonely hours. And we've got the happy couple, Mr. and Mrs. Christopher and Kerry Williams. 